everybody, Jay is back, and I am going to give you a little team update, uh, let's see how I'm doing right now, and uh, I still have not been able to just grind out head-to-head -to -head just to get top 100, I'm a little bit lazy, as I can also get lazy and play in this game and put on YouTube sometimes, just sometimes I'm in, the, I'm in the mood for Madden, sometimes I am not. And uh, as you see, the record right now, pretty good, pretty good. Um, I'm playing pretty decent right now head-to-head. -head. Uh, I'm actually on a 39 game win streak. That ain't bad, considering I don't usually play too many bums too often. And tend to play a lot of people that are pretty decent. So that's how that's going. We are currently at a 96 overall, and our team is 100% different. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with my next couple of videos. I might do gameplays. I might actually do player reviews, because some of these guys are really nice. We're 96 overall now. We're pretty high and everything. Um, we went team of the year basically everywhere on the offensive line. And we still got Mike Pouncey right there at center. We like him. Uh, I just picked up this Rob Gronkowski. I don't know if I'll pick up the 98 overall Rob Gronkowski. And then I think last time I posted a gameplay video, I was using Tony Romo and RG3. I actually had been using uh, Cam Newton for the last week or more than a week. And now we're on Autogram. And Autogram is amazing. And then I decided to get rid of DeMarco Murray, or not, uh, Amon Green. We went DeMarco Murray. DeMarco Murray is really nice. We got Andre Ellington. So uh, Robinson and Austin don't currently see the field too often. Um, I'm currently running Oakland on offense instead of Carolina, so I don't use uh, Austin too much anymore. We went and picked up Steve Smith Sr. during the weekend. Um, the legends were going really cheap. So I figured it was time to upgrade at receiver, and I, I've heard all great things with Steve Smith, and uh, you'll see in the gameplay, I, I do pretty well with him. Here on defense, we have a new safety. We have Steve Atwater. Steve Atwater. <laughs> um, we're still saying linebacking core. I don't see myself changing. Um, I'm a big fan of Ryan Kerrigan, hence if you see my team name, HB Kerrigan. So I don't see myself getting rid of him. We got Cam Chancellor there. He sees the field when I run uh, some pass defenses. Khalil Mack is a beast. Um, maybe we'll get rid of Khalil Mack eventually when the right right side old linebacker presents himself. I don't know. I like my team at the moment. And then we get uh, Bethea. Plays really good. I like Bethea. Um, if I'm using him of safety, I still have Calvin Johnson. I don't. I use him the middle linebacker for the most part. So all that's pretty much the same. But we do have a uh, new nickel. We picked up D'Angelo Hall. Gun for like a. Under 400k coins over the weekend. That's actually really, really good for him. And then we picked up Daryl Dockett. So yeah, that's the team for the most part at the moment. Uh, I don't think anyone cares about Mason Crabby. We're probably going to keep Percy, uh, Percy Harvin as my nickel. Um, might eventually get a new number two, Mike Evans. I don't face catch too much anymore. Um, I don't know. I like to have a big possession receiver at number two. We might end up upgrading there eventually. I don't know who I would get, though. Uh... Not quite sure. I wish I still had Kelvin Benjamin, but uh, just it didn't seem I didn't use Kelvin Benjamin as that much as I probably should have. And then Percy Harvin, perfect slot receiver. Um, maybe when the year gets towards the end, Steve Smith might move to number three receiver. But I do like speed and elusiveness in my number one receiver. And yeah, it's my team. Uh, I I actually really enjoy the team. I really like that I got D'Angelo Hall on my team now. Uh, I am a Redskin fan, so I try to have Redskin players on the team. But uh, I don't know. I'm I'm a believer in uh, scheme over team. But it's you play a lot of. Uh, I seem I, I I play stack teams every game for the most part. So it's it's nice to have. Uh, stack team of your own so hopefully the bullshit doesn't go too much against you anyways thanks for watching peace